Book your seat for the Champions League. Tickets are available online at mcfc.co.uk forward slash tickets or over the phone by calling 0161 treble 4 1894. Alan from Sky, Manuel, uh, good afternoon. Um, can I ask you, first of all, have you spoken to, to Yaya Toure and how is he since, um, since Wednesday? And do you agree with his, the stance that he's taken on the issue? Yes, I spoke with, uh, with Yaya. Uh, I think he, he's okay. I, I think that Yaya did the, the right thing to say what, uh, what happened, and now UEFA, or we will see what UEFA will, will, will do about, about that. What do you expect from UEFA? I suppose that the UEFA is doing a specially a campaign uh, against the, the racism. I, I think they will have the, the, right, uh, the right things for, for the future, not to repeat. But I don't know how, what they are going to do. Michel Platini, has, has, in the last few minutes, has, has requested an internal investigation to find out why the protocol for dealing with incidents of a racist nature wasn't followed, so that in itself is good news for you. Well, that's why I repeat about uh, what I just said. UEFA must take the, the right decision about that. What, what would you do in a situation if one of your players did walk off the pitch in a situation like that? Well, I, uh, I don't think I don't think it's good to, to continue in the same the same thing. I think the, that we did here all we all what we can do. We can't do it anymore. It's very important uh, now the, to to EFA uh, the right uh, they will they will take in the future. Here in, in this club, we don't have any problem in that sense. We, uh, we have our fans, so I think it's, it's not good to continue with, with the same thing. We must wait what will happen in the future about uh, our EFA right. Did you personally hear it on on the night, or? or did, did you speak to anybody at CSKA or was it just representatives from the club? No, 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 I didn't speak with you. I, 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 didn't, I didn't know, I didn't hear about, uh, about what happened after the press conference they told me, but, but I didn't speak. I ju just, I just the final situation on, on this, Yaya's quote about 2018 and boycotting the, the World Cup, would you go along with that? Would you support his stance? I think, I repeat, that we must wait what UEFA will do. Big game Sunday. For you, is this the, the biggest game of your season? Not for season me. So no, far? not for me. It's, it's, it's a tough game for Manchester City. It's again Manchester City against against Chelsea. We are one, one point behind them, behind them, and we we hope we can do a, or we must do a very good match if we want to win. And you meet up with Jose Mourinho again, who's in the past not been too complimentary about you. Does that concern you at all? No, no, I don't know him. Really, I don't know him. He, he worked in Spain. I work in another club, and. We, we play Real Madrid against Malaga and nothing more. I don't have any complaint about him. You're very different characters, aren't you? He's Maybe a different way of thinking about his life. Manuel, just to go back to the issue of racism, have you been surprised by the reaction in Russia and no. by the, the complete denial I by think CSKA? Really, I think that I answer all what I think about that. Huh? I think it's not good to continue in the same way. We must wait what we UEFA will, will do. In the past, do you think UEFA have been strong enough on this issue? No, it's not my duty to tell them. And finally on this, we, you were asked just a second. I will answer the same question. But, no, but continue if, with if, the same ask a question sure, because I, I will ask the same answer. I understand. If man, in the future, if Yaya was to suffer this kind of abuse again, would you support him if he chose to, left, to leave the field? Um, we, I hope that it will not will, uh, happen in the future. Um, in the past, Mourinho has been very outspoken about you. Is it mm. mind games he plays with you? Do, you? do you get involved in that? No, I never get involved in the moment. And I mean, will not get involved now. Mm. And just how important is it a game for, for gauging where Manchester City are and, and your hopes for the rest of the season? But I don't understand. <coughs> Of course, it's an important moment. Always an important moment about uh, playing uh, against the team that also has, has a lot of chance to, to win the, the Premier League. I repeat uh, the same thing I said uh, when we played against Manchester United. It's a, it's a match of six points. They play at, at home. It's, this is our third play, our third game playing away. We hope we can continue winning exactly the same both both games. Can I ask you about um, Sergio Aguero? 
is he's started nine times this season, scored nine goals. Is it possible to say why he's made such a good start to this season? Well, because he's a top player. <laughs> That's, uh, the, I think, the second reason. Uh, I'm always talking with, with Sergio that he, for me, is the, one of the five top players of the world and he must be trying to demonstrate every game he, every game he played. He's, he, I think he's playing with more, in, with more intensity when we don't have the ball and, uh, and uh, he has, a, he has a, a lot of quality to make the difference. And I don't know if you know, but when he scored for Manchester City, they've never lost. Is it possible to say why he's so important to the club? I, I repeat, it's important because he's a top player. I don't know if it's really the statistics say that he, we never that Manchester City never lost when he when he scored. But I think he he's an important player for us. He was an important player also in the past he, with his goal. Manchester City won the title. So, and we hope that in the future he will continue being a very important player for the club. Does this game put down a marker in terms of how the title may go this season? No, no. I think that in the this is the ninth game. I think that uh, we have a lot of games in the future. It's not the most important game of the year. It's an important game, but it will it will not decide nothing at the moment. And just finally, for me, uh, injury wise, uh, still no Vincent, or does he have a chance? Or? No, no, no. Vincent is, is still injury. He'll not have a chance to play this game. And Jack, has he got a chance? And Jack Rodwell is he's okay. Any others? Any other new injuries that we don't know about? Or everybody else okay? No more injuries. Just just Vincent company. All the other players are are okay at fitness. Book your seat for the Champions League. Tickets are available online at mcfc.co.uk forward slash tickets or over the phone by calling 0161 444 1894.